What's up everybody? Just woke up. I slept in longer than I needed to guys. Today we have some Dead Man Mode Armageddon updates that just hit as soon as before I went to sleep guys. So let's talk a little bit about them. They have boats of the Morgan's Javelins guys. These were pretty bad. This is good. Now the uh, damage per hit is 10. It used to be like 1 or 10. It used to be so bad. Uh, I haven't got kills with it. Um, but now you can because the damage per hit is 10 guys. So... It actually is a good range weapon now, and right after I right after I stop being a range tank, that happens. By the way, but hey, they are 300k. Being a ranger is not the most cheapest thing, guys. So the UI now reflects the remaining time before the, the year's dead man. Okay, okay, nice. Correctly reflects. Remove warning that messages when uh, schedule four or simply charge. Don't know about that. Increase the quantity of breach NPCs at region breaches. That's very cracked for us. That means uh, the prices of uh, stuff is going to go down, though. I mean, it, because if there's going to be more of those uh, thingies, then all those trinkets, all those freaking crutch items are going to go down a little. That being said, it's only been one day since then. Uh, update slayer points required to choose the task when using the digital slaughter. Oh, very nice. Oh, they, they actually uh, nerfed the sigil of slaughter a little. Once you log into the Dead Man Permanent World, uh, the players may be reformed, they must reset their account. I thought they did that. Dead Man Tournament's accounts, especially one defense, can now progress through Heroes Quest. That's pretty cool. Anyways, th let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, sorry guys, I'm running on low sleep, but... Uh, Dead Man's uh, mode uh, changes, guys. Let's go. We'll be live on Twitch.